this video, let us learn about the incel graph using the error bars that is shown here. This technique is a creative way to visualize data directly within cells using error bars to present the data points. It's an effective method to make your data more engaging without relying on traditional charts. Let's get started. Purpose This is a bar chart kind of thing to showcase the progress of each project on a single page for comparison. We have the sample data with project wise percentage figures like this and let's try building some graph. Select the range from B7 to C17. Go to Insert tab. Click on 2D clustered bar chart. Click on Vertical Axis to Format Axis. Click on Categories in Reverse Order checkbox. Remove the title and horizontal axis. No fill the chart area. Remove grid lines. Select the graph. And in the menu bar, go to Chart Design tab. Under Add Chart Element, click on Error Bars and select the standard error bars. Right click on Error Bars and click on Format Error Bars. In the Error Amount, select the Percentage Radio button and put the value as 100%. Now select the bar, add data labels, add some color in the data labels and select the bar to fill with no color. Again, click on format error bars. In the fill tab, select the end arrow type and select the dash type. Increase the line width to one point to add visual value. Then you can remove the vertical axis and give a final touch up to make it more professional. We will now adjust the error bars to fit within the cells. You can also change the color to make it more visually appealing. Now you can make the final touches, hide the chart borders, align the chart perfectly. And after formatting it further, you can see the final output like this. And that's how you can create an in-cell graph using error bars in Excel. This technique is a fantastic way to make your data visually engaging and easy to interpret directly within your spreadsheet. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe for more Excel tutorials. If you have any questions or specific topics you, you would like us to cover, to feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you friends, thanks for watching. And if you have any questions or topics you would like us to cover in future videos, let us know in the comments below. Thank you friends, thanks for watching.